Chan, opening eyes. Opening eyes. And next is what? Next, ask the patient to close his eyes and again see whether he able to can able to stand without any sway. Okay? Understood? So first is what? With open eyes. Next is with closed eyes. Now tell me what happens in case of here? No, 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 no. So this is in case of benign paroxysmal positional vertigo. In case of benign paroxysmal positional vertigo, it is negative. Negative means open eyes, normal, closing eyes, normal. He can able to stand. What about in case of UVH? Acute positive. Acute, positive, chronic, negative. Acute means, in acute condition, positive means what? Open eyes, no problem. Closed eyes, this is what? Rhombus, positive. Acute conditions of unilateral vestibular hyperfunction, positive. In chronic, negative. What about in case of bilateral? Acute, positive, chronic, negative. Same in case of bilateral. What about in case of central? Often negative. Huh? Negative. Negative. It is negative. What is the next test? Tandem rhombus. So next is what? Tandem rhombus test. This is what? Tandem. Okay? This is what? Tandem. One foot in front of the other foot. Okay? Now same thing. Open eyes. Then close eyes. Okay? So what is there in case of BPV? In case of benign? Negative. Negative. Means in case of benign paroxysmal positional vertigo, no problem. Here? Okay. Closing eyes? Okay. In case of same? No. Positive eye closed. Positive eye closed. That is what? Positive means with closing eyes, you may have shaking. But open eyes? No problem. Yeah. Positive. Positive. Positive in? Bilateral vestibular hyperfunction. What about in central? Positive. Central is also positive. Okay? Okay? See, I will ask you in your exam, practical exam to demonstrate this. You have to demonstrate and you have to tell this. Okay? What is the next one? So, we finished Rombox test and we finished tandem Rombox. What is the next one? Single leg distance. Single leg standing. Okay? What is in case of BBV? Negative. BPB, negative means what? He will be good. No problem. There is no problem. What is next in case of UVH? Maybe positive. Maybe positive means maybe they may have some problem in standing on one leg. What about in bilateral? Acute positive, chronic negative. Acute, acute they may have positive, they can't be able to stand. In case of chronic negative means they can be able to maintain. What about in central? Maybe uh, Maybe positive or negative? Problem. Maybe pronounced ataxia. Pronounced yeah. ataxia means they may have more uh, swaying and all. Okay? What is the next one? Gate. Ah. Gate. Gate yeah. means walking. Okay? If you yeah. observe the gate, it is normal in case of BPPV. What about in the next? Acute wide basic. In case of BP, in case of unilateral vestibular hyperfunction, wide based. Next. Slow. Slow. Decreased arm swing. There is no decreased no arm swing. Next. Trunk rotation. No trunk rotation, nothing. So how they will walk? They will walk slowly with wide based. No swinging, no trunk rotation. Generally, how will you walk? You will walk like this with trunk rotation and arm swinging. But in case of this problem, how they will work? Wide base, okay, without no swinging, okay, no trunk rotations. Next. Uh, acute, uh. Uh, wide base, slow, decreased mm. arm swing and trunk. So that is in again bilateral. What about in central? Uh, May not be source. May it is not there. No problem. Next, next is what turning head. Next is what ask the person to turn his head while walking. In benign paroxysmal there won't be much problem. 
But in case of unilateral uh, bilateral and all, patient may lose balance while doing head movements. Okay. So in case of balance test, what are the balance tests we have to perform? Rambach test with open eyes and closed mm -hmm. eyes, and you have to see for tandem, tandem Rambach test, mm -hmm. and next is single leg stance. Next you have to see for gait mm -hmm. and gait walking with head movement. Okay, so that is about balance test. Okay.